I'm sure you've seen someone pay for something at a retail store with a simple wave of their phone over the credit card terminal with no physical credit card in hand. If you're curious how that's done, in this particular case, it's accomplished using NFC technology and a mobile wallet on the customer's phone. So if you wanna know about how NFC works, how it's used, or maybe how to set up a system with NFC payments in your business, I'm gonna talk about all that today. While most people have a smartphone, NFC technology is not exclusive to phones. Mobile wallets are indeed apps that live on your smartphone and will cover digital wallets in just a minute, but NFC technology also exists in watches, tablets, and credit card terminals as well as point of sale equipment. NFC technology is nothing new and it's been around since 2007, so first off let's define it. NFC stands for Near Field Communication and very simply it facilitates the transfer of data or information from one NFC equipped device or hardware to another. You can transfer payment data as well as general information such as contact deals or pictures and videos. NFC is a communication technology similar to a radio frequency or Bluetooth except it's designed exclusively to only work within a specific and limited range and in practice this is often only about four inches of range or less. The vast majority of NFC use does involve a physical mobile phone and since we're talking about payment data in this video we'll apply this to the transfer of a credit card payment that is stored on the mobile phone inside of a mobile wallet to the credit card terminal or the point of sale device so let's look at what a mobile wallet is first off as I mentioned it's an app that lives on a smartphone that part is pretty straightforward the common popular ones that you've likely heard of are Apple pay Google pay and Samsung pay after the mobile wallets downloaded onto the phone one or more personal credit cards can be saved saved and stored on the app in a secure and encrypted fashion for future use. Credit cards are added to a digital wallet, oftentimes by simply taking a picture of the card and letting the app do the rest. Credit cards can also be manually entered into the mobile wallet. So how does a payment work? Well, in practice, when a payment's ready to be made, instead of the traditional swipe or dip with a physical card, the phone is simply held within four inches of the credit card terminal itself and the two devices talk to each other via the NFC technology. When the phone is placed over the point of sale device, the credit card information that is stored inside the mobile wallet on the phone transfers to the credit card machine, allowing the customer to pay for their product or service. In some cases, and depending on the type of credit card terminal, the customer might not even need to touch the terminal at all. It's also worth mentioning, as a quick side note, that NFC technology, when it comes to processing payment transactions, is available on physical credit cards too. If the credit card displays the contactless payment icon, then the physical credit card can be used in the same way that a mobile wallet or digital wallet can be in that it can be used just by waving the physical credit card over the point of sale device when prompted to do so. If your business uses a credit card terminal that is equipped with a point to point encryption software, the mobile wallet passes an encrypted token instead of an actual credit card number making it a very secure transaction. Essentially, this means that a unique digital signature is created to initiate the transaction for every single transaction that takes place. Then the normal credit card processing transaction cycle takes place and the payment processor communicates with the customer's bank to verify funds, approves the transaction, and then transfers the money from the customer's account to your dedicated merchant account. So if you wanna be able to accept mobile wallets and contactless payments via NFC technology, it's actually quite simple to do and simple to set up. A couple votes in favor of utilizing NFC technology is that it's fast and convenient. It's advanced data security, as I mentioned with point-to-point -point encryption. It's a contactless process and it is in very high customer demand. Virtually every late model cell phone has NFC technology built into it. And since everyone loves to use their phones for just about everything nowadays, why not jump on the growing trend and give your customers the ability to make a payment at your store with their phone? And here's a quick stat to back that claim up that's published by Fiserv.com. And it says that 68% of consumers have used a digital wallet in the last 12 months compared to 58% in 2020 and 49% in 2019. 
that survey and that data comes from 3,033 interviews. So there's no doubt that it's a growing trend and every option that you give yourself as a business to accept a digital payment or a electronic payment from your customers just makes it that much easier and more likely that you will actually make a sale. The more popular the trend becomes, the more that your customers will assume that they will be able to use a mobile wallet at your store. If you're old enough to remember the emergence of credit cards themselves back in the 70s and 80s, consider this. At some point, it became an inconvenience to shop at a store that didn't accept credit cards. If cash was the only option, people didn't like it as much. And as credit cards became more popular, people stopped carrying cash. Well, nowadays, people have stopped not only carrying cash as much, some don't even carry credit cards anymore because of mobile wallets. So are you following trends and are you missing out on sales by not implementing contactless capable credit card machines? It's extremely inexpensive to get an NFC enabled point of sale system or a contactless credit card terminal in your store. So if you want more details about that, of course, check the links as usual in the description. If you learned something new today, please consider giving this video a thumbs up, share it with a friend that's always appreciated and it helps these videos get found. Once again, there's links in the description area of this video. If it was a cited link or video, be sure to check out the description area if you're doing research on this topic. And if you want to talk specifically about NFC technology or mobile wallets at your business, check the links to schedule an appointment with myself or one of my team members. So that's all for now. I'm Brian Manning and I'll see you on the next one.